Christmas morning, the whole family's together, gifts under the tree, nice warm fire going, but most important, we have our dogs with us. That was Boo, and up there is her granddaughter, Apple, and there's another granddaughter floating by, Bella, who is going to say hello to her Aunt Bootsy, with Grandpa Dylan right behind, and of course, Mika the Husky. And she's thirsty, I guess. And Mika did not leave us alone while we were opening our gifts. It was nice. Our daughter was there on the left, our granddaughter on the, on the right. She had the chore of distributing all the gifts to everybody, which, uh, judging by the amount that was there, was really quite a bit. And, of course, there's Bootsy looking on to see what's going on. That, by the way, is Zen, who is a puppy we bred but lives in another home. And he was there as a guest. That's Auntie Tag. And so there were plenty of gifts there to keep everybody happy. Santa was very good to us this year. He was especially good to my wife, Katie, who received a blanket handmade by our granddaughter, Alyssa. Keeps her nice and warm. And, of course, Apple's saying, hey, what's wrong with me? I can't keep you warm. Alyssa went into silly hat mode for a while, but I guess she really liked that particular gift. Has a little cushion on the back of her neck so she can use it when she travels. That's very handy. And look at that pile of gifts on the couch. What, what, what? Oh, wait, tag. I guess she's old enough to warrant a good nap. I wish I could have had a nap. It was a very busy morning. And aside from all the wonderful little treats and toys, the dogs got their Christmas presents too. There's Mika getting some love and a little belly rub, which all dogs love to have. Of course, Zen is now saying, what about me? I didn't get a belly rub. Where's Santa? I want a belly rub. And then he just kind of wandered off to say hello to the other whole color cavaliers who are around. Dylan especially being very friendly to him. You might recognize him. So Zen did eventually get some of that love. And look at, oh, look at how he puts his head down when he's getting rubbed. Dylan, on the other hand, was very content to just sit and wait to be wrapped up as a gift himself. Amazing for his age that he is so compliant, doesn't seem to mind. He actually seemed to enjoy being wrapped up for Christmas. And after a few minutes of settling in, watching the other dogs go by, I think he just figured, whoops, I guess I can just go to sleep here. And he drifted off into his own little nap. Dylan had a really restful winter's nap. Some of us humans were kind of jealous of that. And after all the opening of gifts was done, oh my God, look at the mess. At least we got the wrapping paper into a garbage bag. Looks like the one who did the best in all this was Amazon, if I'm not mistaken. Zen kind of looking around to see if there was anything for him. He got a few little treats and things. And Mika apparently found her own gift she was interested in. Well, it's been a very lovely gift exchange for Christmas. And we had not only our human family, but our canine family with us. Right, Bootsy? And I just have to say that although some of these things have nothing to do with our dogs, um, you know, like a little thing for my little thing for my stereo or some security cameras and stuff like that. Um, but there are a lot of things that are related to the dogs. I got a lot of clothing, a lot of it dog related. As is this shirt, which I suppose I can't really wear in the summertime, but it's long sleeve, so it's okay. Even things you wouldn't guess, like, for example, a brand new tripod, um, much sturdier than the one that I've been using. So watch the upcoming videos. They're probably going to be a little more steady. And this book, which is a really excellent reference for judging at dog shows, it's one I've wanted for a while, and so... I have some reading to do before my next judging assignment. And I hope everybody who's watching has had a wonderful holiday, whether it's Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, bleh, the pagan solstice celebration, whatever. I hope you had a good time with your family. And 
with your dogs. <laughs>